if you have a list of email addresses and you need to see where someone has changed the email address. So for example, up here, all the um, domains are acme.com, but down here you can see the acme.new. So a quick way to do this, long list, all the email addresses in one column. So the first thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna highlight it, go data, I'm just gonna sort it. Now when it's sorted, you can see here, I can see visually that those two are the same person, but two different domain names. But there's quite a few here. So a quick way to find duplicates. Now because of the domain name changing, what we're gonna do is just adjacent to it. So there's column A, right next door in column B. I'm just gonna type the, the name part of it. So A dot, okay, so like that. And then I can, under data, is an item called flash fill. When I click flash fill, you'll see whatever I did here, so I took the first name out of the email address, it tries to mimic it. So you'll see it's doing the same thing. And here you can see these two are exactly the same. What we can now do, again, because it does involve you looking in and understanding what's duplicate or not, is I would highlight that column, go to home, conditional formatting, highlight cell rules, and look for duplicate values. That's okay. And now it's very obvious where there are duplicates. And at this stage, you can work through and decide which one is correct or not, and delete it or do whatever you need to do with it.